Hi guys, thank you very much for tuning on to your favorite channel today. This is Kirsty Valentine. I have news for um, new parents. If you are a new parent and you've just given birth to a baby, please, I know people are going to be coming over to uh, wish you well. Well wishes are going to be coming. Relatives, friends, neighbors are going to be coming. Please do not allow them to... Um, hug and kiss your baby because it might turn out to be very fatal. In this case, I would name this baby Baby P for privacy issues. Baby P um, was born last year around um, August, September and during his christening, he came back home with an infection, a deadly infection and this infection is herpes. A four-week-old baby who who was being christened at the church came back home infected with herpes herpes is hsv minus one virus in adults it is known as the cold sore but in newborn babies it is deadly because if it is not detected in time the virus spreads rapid the virus goes into the brain of the baby goes into the virus goes into other vital organs of the baby and shuts it down and the baby is dead in this case the mother of the baby i will call her mommy p went and did her research she's a very clever woman and she went to see her doctor and she kept persisting and insisting that it is hsv minus one herpes virus and she was referred to the bansley uh, hospital and when she got there she kept persisting and when they test they started treating the baby for um herpes and they took some blood samples they took some tests and when the test came back they actually found out that mama p um actually was right the baby will have been infected had come down with the herpes virus um you know when you have your baby people come in and they hug your baby they give your baby kisses and sometimes your baby is in the pram uh in uh, you know people come so close they are talking so close they open their mouth all all that spits you know it's coming onto the baby's face some people are hugging the baby and you can see the baby stretching and wingling all that breath you see you don't know where people have put their mouth i don't mean to be wrong you don't know if the person has sucked a dick or suck a pussy last night and didn't brush or wash them up properly they come and hold your baby and they kiss your baby and that's it your baby gets that virus i also want to say please especially in the african community i know we are so used to friends coming to see us in the hospital carrying the baby and when they carry the baby they are talking they open their mouth and you know africans we have big mouths and big lips they are talking they are opening their mouth they, they say Saliva is, is, is spilling like rain upon upon the baby. Before you know it, the baby is ill. You are in and out of the hospital. You really need to stop that. When you go into the hospital, have your baby come out. Not on the baby is well and everything. I, I think you shouldn't even tell anybody. You know, this baby went for his own christening and came back infected. Now the baby had been had, she has been under treatment all this while since September. But guess what? The baby has relapsed and now it is very, very serious. The baby has to take um inject one hour of antiviral um for one hour every day three times a day in the last six months and the treatment is going to go on till october so i want to use this opportunity to say to all parents protect your baby if you stop do not allow anybody to hug or kiss your baby your baby is your treasure you cannot buy your baby in the market or in tesco's or sainsbury's it's god's gift it's a blessing so guys Press that beautiful red button on the right of your screen, the best button for notifications. In that way, you know when I go live streaming or a new video have been uploaded. Press the thumbs up for like. Always remember to leave a comment. In that way, we keep our conversation interesting and buzzing. Like, um, share this video with your colleagues at work, your neighbors, your family, and your friends. In that way, we keep education mainstream and striving in our communities. Until our next video, Kirsty Valentine is saying to you all guys peace and love